What's up, everyone, and welcome back to Movie Raise. After Tom Holland announced he'll be taking a break from acting, the world has not been the same. It's practically the end of an era. That's why today we're going through all of his movie roles and actings. You'll be surprised how many roles Tom has under his belt. Meet Spider-Man. I am responsible. I. Before we get into Tom Holland's acting and movie roles, we thought it would be best to mention some facts about the incredibly talented actor. Holland was born in London, England on June 1, 1996. His parents are named Dominic Holland and Nikki Holland. Out of his four brothers, Holland is the eldest one. His brothers are Harry Holland, Sam Holland, and Patty Holland. Sam and Harry are twins, so there you go. That's his family. And we couldn't go on without mentioning this amazing photograph of Holland, his dad, and Emma Watson. Adorable. Now let's get into careers stuff, shall we? Tom's career started out with dancing dance classes as a kid. He even said his mom thought he had a natural rhythm, so she was like, you should go to a dance class. Holland then took classes every Saturday in the YMCA in Wimbledon. However, he later showed a passion for an acting career, which leads us to his first role ever, Billy and Billy Elliot the Musical. Holland was 12 years old when he got his first role. He appeared in Billy Elliot the Musical in September 2000. Then in 2012, Holland played the role of Lucas in The Impossible. This is practically the film that proved Holland is a really talented actor. His portrayal of Lucas, a young boy whose family experienced a tsunami while on vacation, opened a lot of doors in his acting career. Moments 2013. In this short film, Tom plays a boyfriend every one of us dreams of. The film is only three minutes long, so for those of you who haven't seen it, we won't spoil it for you. Eddie and Locke, 2013. In this film, Holland lends the voice of Eddie. This is a must-watch masterpiece that takes place throughout a single car ride, with the camera placed on one face from start to finish. Isaac and How I Live 2013 How I Live follows the story of an American teenager, Daisy, a character played by Saris Ronan and her British cousins Eddie, played by George McKay, Isaac, played by Tom Holland, and Piper, played by Harley Bird. They all attempt to reunite during an apocalyptic nuclear war. War. Gregory and Wolf Hall TV Miniseries 2015. In this miniseries, Holland played the role of Gregory Cromwell. He appeared in a total of five episodes. Tweet Short 2015. According to IMDb, Tweet follows a plot of a young boy visiting his grandfather where they build a birdhouse. Thomas in the Heart of Sea 2015. Prior to meeting in the MCU, Holland spent some time with Chris Hemsworth in a film they worked on together. In the Heart of Sea is one of Holland's most Raised films. Peter Parker, Spider Man in Captain America Civil War 2016. Tom Holland got the role of Peter Parker after five and a half months of auditioning. On June 23, 2015, Holland was announced as the new Spider Man and he instantly became one of the most popular actors in Hollywood. Holland said he went to Spider Man auditions in Ireland, Canada, Atlanta, and Los Angeles. Bradley Baker in Edge of Winter 2016. Edge of Winter follows Joel Kinnaman as a divorced and unemployed man named Elliot Baker. Elliot decides to take his sons, Bradley, Tom Holland, and Caleb, Percy Hines White, on a shooting trip and the nightmare begins. Jack Fawcett in The Lost City of Zed 2017 The Lost City of Zed follows Charlie Hunman as Fawcett, Robert Pattinson as Henry Costin, Sienna Miller as his wife, Nina Fawcett, and Tom Holland as his son, Jack. Brother Dyramid in Pilgrimage 2017 The Pilgrimage cast is amazing. It stars Tom Holland, John Berthnall, and Richard Armitage. The film is written by Jamie Hanning and directed by Brendan Muldowney. Spider-Man Homecoming MB NBA Finals Watch the Game 2017. Obviously, Holland plays Peter Parker's Spider-Man in this short video where he's invited to Tony Stark's NBA Finals viewing party, and yes, it is as amazing as it sounds. Spider-Man Homecoming 2017. This film is considered the best film in the Spider-Man universe so far, so we have to ask, do you agree?
Peter Parker Takes His Driving Test 2017 This is a short video in which Peter Parker takes his driving test. In the video, he fights evil, but that doesn't stop him from getting a driving license. The Current War Director's Cut 2017 Holland plays the role of Samuel Insull. In the movie, he is defending Thomas Edison, played by Benedict Cumberbatch. The Current War also features Michael Shannon as George Westinghouse. Avengers Affinity War 2018 According to Celebrity Network, Holland made two $250,000 for Captain America Civil War, and he also made $3 million each for Avengers Infinity War and Avengers Endgame. Avengers Endgame 2019 In an interview with GQ, directors Joe and Anthony Russo talked about Holland's audition for Spider-Man. Casting director Sarah Finn should get all the credit for casting Holland as Spider-Man, she's the best in the business and she knows us, Joe said. Where should we send thank you cards? Science Affair 2019 In this short film, Peter Nugg competes in a school science fair, and the only bad thing about this film is that it's only three minutes long. Is there any chance this could be turned into a TV show? Spider-Man Far From Home 2019 According to a lot of fans, no one can get any better than the latest actor who played Spider-Man. So yes, a lot of people believe Tom Holland is the best Spider-Man so far. Do you guys agree? Peter's To-Do List 2019 This is yet another short film made about an amazing adventure about Spider-Man in which Peter Parker heads off to Europe, but before he leaves, he needs to take care of some pretty important things. Adi presents Lunch Break 2019 Holland lends the voice of Walter in this short film in which he and Lance Sterling go on their most challenging mission so far. Spies in Disguise 2019 The English actor voices the role of scientist Walter Beckett in the animated film. The cast also includes Will Smith, Karen Gillan, Rashida Jones, Ben Meldeshun, Maxi Oka, and DJ Khaled. Jip and Doolittle 2020 Unfortunately, Eddie Murphy didn't come back to reprise his role as Dr. Doolittle, however, Robert Downing Jr. stepped in to lend the voice. Tom plays Doolittle's assistant, Jip. Jip is Doolittle's dog, and this is, without a doubt, Holland's cutest role so far. Ian Onward 2020 Holland lends the voice for Ian Lightfoot in this wonderful Pixar animation as he reunites with his co-star, Chris Pratt. The two actors have a long history in Disney's Marvel Cinematic Universe, but in this film, they play brothers. We really wish for an Onward sequel. Do you? Onward Magic Gems 2020. Although there is no news for a sequel, Pixar released a short film for Onward named Magic Gems in which Holland reprises his role as Ian. Arvin in The Devil All the Time 2020. In The Devil All the Time, Holland goes on a completely different territory playing a hell of a challenging character. The film stars Robert Pattinson as a wicked villain. Todd and Chaos Walking 2021. After years of no progress at all, Chaos Walking started moving forward and finally got released in 2020. 2021. Based on Patrick Ness's 2008 young adult novel The Knife of Never Letting Go, the first in a trilogy, the film stars Daisy Ridley and Tom Holland. Cherry 2021 In a story about love, fight, addiction, and crime, Tom Holland plays a character that struggles a lot while trying to find peace. Venom Let There Be Carnage 2021 Here's a thing that's been confusing fans for a long time. It's true. Tom Holland briefly shows up at the end of Venom Let There Be Carnage. Spider-Man No Way Home 2021 Spider-Man No Way Home is, without a doubt, the most successful Spider-Man movie of all time. The Daily Bugle TV Series 2021 According to IMDb, this is a story covering the dangerous Spider-Man. Nathan Drake in Uncharted 2022 In Sony's Uncharted movie, Tom Holland plays a treasure hunter Nathan Drake from the popular PlayStation video game series. The Crowded Room TV Series 2023 The Crowded Room is based on a true story about Billy Millingham, Holland's role in the series, which is a man with 24 different personalities. Which of these Tom Holland roles is your favorite? Let us know down in the comments, and if you enjoyed our video, make sure you subscribe to our channel, and thanks for watching.